hi guys welcome back to my channel today i am doing my 23 through 24 pregnancy update i am currently 24 weeks and one day today it's friday so i'm going to be updating you on what has been happening for the past two weeks so last week i didn't really have any changes on my symptoms or my cravings i traveled to limpopo so it was about five hours in the bus going to limpopo and i stayed there for about five days and while i was there we had a family trip to pulukwane which was about six hours return and then the next day i was traveling back to Gauteng, and it was really really windy in pulukwane so the next day i traveled back to jobek which was about five hours again in the bus and then i got here i was fine i managed to do laundry i did like two loads of laundry i ironed everything and put everything away then the next morning i couldn't get out of the bed i was so my back was killing me and my throat it was like someone was choking me my nose were blocked i couldn't breathe properly i was like running out of breath i had tears just falling from my eyes it was like i'm having a hay fever and i drank a little bit of allergics i took a shower i slept and i woke up it was still the same so ever since that day i've been having like these new symptoms like i'm coughing out gag my throat still hurts a little bit but it's getting better now and another thing is my headache i've been having like this crazy headache non-stop and my heartburn is on another level i even wake up in the middle of the night and have like a teaspoon of gaviscon and then go back to sleep so another thing that happened when i was in Limpopo was that my boobs started leaking milk i'm not sure if it's milk 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 but i woke up one morning and i was just lying on the bed and then i was like playing with my nipples and there was like little brown rubber things like dirt so i started scratching them off and then after scratching those things off it was like white dots on my nipples and then i continued scratching on my nipples but i was actually squeezing and then i realized that something is actually coming out so it was like water but with like a white residue so it was like diluted milk and then i read about it i'm like the baby center fan i'm always reading things on the baby center if if i find something funny happening i go in the baby center they have topics about everything pregnancy everything babies everything kids and then i went in and i searched like 23 weeks 20, 24 weeks breast leaking and then there was like topics and what i love about the baby center is that you actually read like real stories like people's comments on the topic and i started reading what other women were saying like it's possible that you can start leaking milk so apparently it's a good thing i won't really have a problem feeding my baby when she's here which is exciting um but it's kind of freaky though <laughs> so i came back to jobbing on sunday and then monday i had an appointment at the clinic so i asked the nurse that was helping me on my appointment and she was like yeah you are six months pregnant so it's possible that you could be leaking milk already and i was like oh my gosh do i need to get breast pads but and she said no it won't really leak leak like as if you're breastfeeding but if you're around babies that are still breastfeeding there's a possibility that your breast can leak and then i remember that when i was in limpopo i had my two nieces one is about 19 months and one is about 24 five months both of them they're still like bottle feeding and also like breastfeeding there and there but i didn't really that didn't really register i didn't know as the first time mom i didn't know what was going on and another thing that happened was weight gain ever since the beginning of my pregnancy my weight has been like fluctuating between like 63 65 66 kg but then monday when i got up on the scale it was 70 kg so i did gain a little bit of weight but then the next explained to me that the baby's starting to gain a lot of weight now she's gaining between 200 and 500 grams 
depending on how fast she's growing oh yeah and another thing that i noticed was swelling my feet and my fingers especially on sunday when i got back here from the bob my feet were like swollen and my fingers were like swelling so i'm just trying to make sure that i rest my feet all the time i sit straight and drink lots of water and as for cravings i didn't really have lots of cravings this past weeks um my heart burn has been like stopping me from eating lots of things even last night i cooked some pasta with like some tomato sauce i couldn't hold it i just threw everything back out uh one thing that i've been craving since home is bananas i ate lots of bananas i even brought some bananas back here i've been eating like lots and lots of bananas daily and when i was at home i was drinking lots of milk and coming back i'm also drinking i even remember last night i asked nathan to get me a glass of milk which was actually good but the problem is the aftertaste the aftertaste just stays for hours so after drinking milk i have to make sure i continue drinking water just to take that taste out of my mouth and um and same with juice i haven't been having juice for the past two three days because the aftertaste is just staying in my mouth and it's annoying and it's making me spit a lot so i'm trying to avoid those so i'm just eating like basic things i'm not really chewing there and there and there and there because it's making me sick my heart bad and the spitting i i'm really not a fan of it it like make me sick um so i'm just trying to avoid eating lots of things and yeah i think that's it for my update i'm going to show you my belly it hasn't really changed a lot on the size but the kicks the kicks she's been kicking me like non-stop she's like really really active oh yeah another thing that i forgot to update you guys on is stretch marks i was just applying on my belly just applying my belly i didn't know that you can actually get stretch marks on the sides of your waist so i'm not sure if you guys can see them but i started noticing some stretch marks here on my waist and also on the other side so i'm also applying some bio oil here but i didn't know i was just rubbing it on my belly so this is my 24 weeks belly and so yeah that's it for my 24 week update i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel and don't forget to enable your notification bell so you don't miss new videos from me and i'll see you guys in my next one bye hey mr mongo